down on my people so we've got some airdrops to keep an eye on and we've got some tasks to complete so firstly we have the venom network which launched its token today um, they have now released a rewards tab and you can see here claim your testnet reward So whoever did the testnet and got NFTs that before the snapshot which I think was on the 15th of March around that time going to be eligible for an airdrop how good this airdrop is going to be I don't know I'm a little bit um, I got a feeling that this one might not cook they launched at around a 5 million market cap which is very low for an L1 and it has done a nice 5x since launching this morning so it's sitting around a 25 million market cap for a project that had claimed it had a billion funding which I think they did um, claim which I think they did state a couple months back that that partnership had fallen through got a feeling that they're going to try and airdrop um, minimal amount of rewards as obviously it looks like they're low on funds considering the market cap the token has launched at but you never know um this is just all speculation i could be completely wrong and venom itself could run into the hundreds of millions or even billions it's only a 25 million market cap it's one of my favorite ecosystems that i've used during testnet stage the uis the interfaces with all the dApps and venom is some of the best cleanest in all of crypto so um i do think venom has big potential yeah we'll see we'll see but we've got two days so when this does go live i will obviously do an announcement so get ready to claim this if you did the test net and got some of those nfts okay and then we have metis um so i did do tutorials on this the test net stages have now ended and there's an nft that you can claim so based on the points you earned from doing the test net there's um three levels of nft elite based and good you're going to need some Metis. So this is on the Metis mainnet. You're going to need to get some Metis from whatever exchange you use, send it over to your wallet to be able to claim this NFT it's under a dollar or even under 50 cent. Do so claim your NFT. I think you're going to need that to qualify for the airdrop. So make sure you come and do this if you've got points with the Metis testnet. And then they have got ongoing quests now on the mainnet, on Metis mainnet where you would be using funds. So they've got like Bridge to Metis, Lenden, Prospera Metis, Aggregate, so Swap. I think they've got a Perps, um, Perps one in there. So yeah, if you want to carry on and keep collecting XP, you can do on the main net. Okay, and then we got T, T Protocol. The next phase, the Jasmine phase has now opened, opened a couple of days ago, and there's eight days left. So what you can do on here now is i mean this is very much driven towards um builders and dApps but there are some tasks that we can do as retail what you can now do is you can stake your t tokens and claim the rewards and you're going to get points for that of course so you would go to oss staking and you're going to stake with a validator so you need to select project and you need to try and reduce the yield of a project. So make go through these projects here and choose a project that's not on zero, that's got a percentage in the yield and stake with that project. And then once you've done that and you've left it for a little bit and the rewards have come through, make sure you claim your rewards here. And then there will be unstake, unstake some tea, but that's not yet available. I tried to do that earlier and um, function was not yet live i want to talk about baby dojo so i did a video on dojo swap some weeks back and if you got in then you would have got your baby dojo airdrop which was pretty nice um having around a thousand dollars in dojo swap you would have got around five hundred dollars worth of baby dojo baby dojo is a reflections token that also buys back the the main um, ecosystem token dojo and burns it and it's currently at around 11 million market cap and the reflections come through daily and you claim your reflections but what i want to speak about it is there's some airdrops coming for baby dojo holders so um yeah do some research but it could be worth getting in on baby dojo so the market cap small i think the dojo swap team is one of the best teams i've seen with how transparent and how much work they're putting in and how much um different um utilities they're releasing got the third token of the ecosystem coming daojo so um this is going to be a governance token by the sounds of it a few days left to get in on this airdrop if it's similar to baby dojo it should be a pretty nice airdrop and then there's a few more airdrops coming we've got this here um 
Yakuza, which is going to be similar to the Sushi um, NFT. So this is going to be an NFT which is connected to a token. And there was already one launched through Dojo Swap called Sushi, which there was an airdrop for from Holding Dojo. And Sushi has done about a 4x. Those NFTs are now worth over a thousand dollars, and they was worth around 200 or 150 when it first launched, and so more like a 6x. So this could do similar. And holding baby dojo will get you an airdrop on this. Okay, and that wraps this one up. So um, yeah, I'm looking forward to this Venom airdrop. Intrigued to see how this drop is gonna go. Make sure you claim your Metis NFT for doing the test net. You're gonna need that for the airdrop most likely. Do the T protocol um tasks to get your points and take a look at baby dojo if you're not already in it and if you are in it then we've got some airdrops coming for us if you've got any questions need any help leave it in the comments i will get back to you like and subscribe to stay up to date with the alpha turn those notifications on and i will see you in the next one